It's just a document, but for many, it holds the key to their identities. Thanks to a fairly new law in Illinois, thousands of adoptees have received their original birth certificates. Roseanne Tejas has this original report of a Mokina woman's emotional journey and efforts to expand adoption laws. It, it's mine. It's, it was my birth. It's about me. My name is on it. It pertains to me. Oh, it has her name. <laughs> Tracy Theodore is one of nearly 10,500 Illinois adoptees who sent in applications to receive their original birth certificates since the law was passed. There's a piece missing, there's a hole, there's, there's a piece that you want filled. Her birth mother was given a chance to remove her name before the law went into effect. I had the paperwork, it was completed, it was notarized, they never got mailed. Because I knew deep down that we really needed to connect after reading her letters. For Tracy, it was a search for answers. Giving birth to my own children, I know that had to be just heart-wrenching to do what she did. And I, and I wanted to know she was okay. Tracy and several other Illinois adoptees are featured in a documentary being screened tomorrow in Chicago, a simple piece of paper. And I believe that telling the story with this film has also changed the hearts and minds of policy and lawmakers. Representative Sarah Feigenholt says Illinois is playing an important role in expanding rights of adoptees. It's their truth. It's their information. Now, some adoptees receive notices that their birth certificates can't be found. Well, tomorrow, Governor Quinn will sign a bill that will give them a chance to search other county adoption files looking for answers. Robin Kate. Yeah, so powerful, just a piece of paper, but just the knowledge that they have a name or maybe that they don't even have a name, that they saw it and it doesn't have a name. Right, exactly. A lot of these uh, adoptees and their newfound families will be at a screening at the Center, for Hall, uh, Center on Halstead tomorrow, a screening of that documentary that shows the connections taking place. All right. Thank you, Roseanne.